Hey guys, hey, what's good? How you doing? Hey, uh, just getting back from a 22 mile bike ride and getting ready to uh, prep my pit, prep my meat for my cook tonight on the ABS Pit Boss. And hey, I got I got a couple of shoulders and I got a brisket that I already seasoned. Hey, I'm a simple cook, salt and pepper in my brisket. That's it. You know, uh, maybe sometimes some some garlic, but another net is pretty much salt and pepper. But hey, look, one of my smoke buddies, his name is Toby Thurkill. Hope I pronounced that right, Toby. And uh, he uh, hit me up to this right here, this hardcore carnivore. So I'm gonna try it out tonight on the ABS, and I'm gonna try it out on one of my beef shoulders or my beef cloths. Now, a couple of guys are asking me, hey, how do you uh? Uh, prep your your shoulder your shoulder shoulder claws or beef shoulders. Usually, I'm a salt and pepper guy. Sometimes garlic, but one person asked me, "Hey, how do you uh, how do how, how have you been quartering your beef shoulders?" And I'm gonna show you in just a minute. But it's one thing I do want to let you guys know. When I first started cooking these, I've been taking all this all this skin off the fat, you know. But I've been leaving the fat the fat cap on, uh, so. When you do this one, it has a little bit of skin, but on the back side, right, it has this great fat right here. So I've been leaving this on, and then when I shred it up, all that good fat goes into the meat. But you just have to just, just it's gonna render down because there's some hard sinew under here, but it renders down. Uh, so if you see my other cooks uh, from yesterday on the uh, vote, you'll see that great bark that was on that fat cap, which is this part right here. So, you know, I've been, so this one right here is a whole one. Some You can smoke them whole if you want to, or you can go ahead and quarter them up like I got these two, right? And I'm gonna be using this one. I'm gonna be using a hardcore carnivore right there and putting it on and seasoning, seasoning it up, just that alone. Uh, so you can see here, it's, it's a full, it's a full clod and I quartered them up. So if you look here, uh, split them down the middle first, and then I quartered them. All right, so there you have it, all quartered. And the same thing with this one. These right here is going to be salt and pepper. This one right here by itself, uh, just that hardcore carnivore, and it has some good seasons in there too. It has pepper, salt, garlic, uh, onion powder, and some activated black charcoal, uh, which I never heard before, but I did taste it, and I tell you what, it tastes really good and it has a lot of pepper content okay uh, let me wipe my hands off real quick and we can go ahead and season this first so you guys can see it oh but just look at that really dark so we're gonna go with open that okay oh it has nice big holes too that's what i like to see okay so let's hold this right here uh we'll start off with i'm trying to see if i got enough room to do this we'll do that one first and let's look at this. Look how dark. That's that's really dark. And it says go heavy on it. And that's what I'm gonna do. You know, I'm not I'm not really a huge fan of dark, dark bark, but this stuff tastes good just by finger touch. And I can't wait for it to you know smoke through the whole the whole night. So we're gonna see man, just look at that. Ooh, let's see. Let's see. Now I'm gonna try to get all. I'm gonna get all four sides. I'm gonna get all sides. One side I get off, but we're just gonna season all this up. And I didn't use any kind of binder. I'm just going. I don't use binders on my meat. If I do, it's it's gonna be water. Just water. Let's put that over. Wow. And we're gonna go heavy on this fat cap. I mean the bottle. It's a. It's a. Uh, I think it's a sixteen ounce. No. Uh, I can't. Even see. Yeah, I think that's a uh, fourteen ounces. I think, and it, it was sixteen dollars. So that's kind of expensive, you know. So yeah, I'm just gonna try it out, but uh, to keep my cost down. I'm just salt and pepper guy. But this is my first time using this stuff. Okay. 
Look how dark that is. Let me see if I can do one more. And I'm going to let it sit. I'm, I'm going to get all these sides too. I'm going to do one more. And I'm going to let it sit out for a couple hours. Because I don't plan on putting this stuff on all my meat on. Uh, to probably about 9.30 tonight. Wow. That's dark stuff. So all you guys who like that dark <laughs> that dark bark, hey, this might be right up your alley. But man, look at that. Mmm. That's really good. I could taste it's heavy on garlic too. And heavy on pepper. Mmm, that's really good. Brisket. And then I'm gonna go ahead and season the rest of this up. And I think we'll be good to go. Okay, guys? Hey. Bring you back about 9.30 tonight and then about 4 or 5 o'clock in the morning to look how this came through. And then I will do a finish up uh, cutting process and tasting with that also. Blessing to you. And hey, we'll bring, we'll bring you back later on tonight.